How's it lollipopping, you dark purveyors? This is Megan Nair, back with the latest on the Grasshopper Direct 2024. It was marvelous, truly amazing. 40 minutes undedicated to Shadows of the Damned. Brand new stories from the era of Kudayami. Inspiring tales of one publisher's gentle creative nudges. While Suda5150 did not make an appearance, this round table was a fully loaded bone. <clears throat> Suda51 and Shinji Mikami discussed the road trips that paved the way for Garcia and Johnson's relationship. Grasshopper D manufacturer drummer Massimo Guarini appeared and reflected on his time directing the original game in 2011. And never mind on real engine killing wasted resources. It seems Grasshopper was so ahead of the curve that Unreal Engine had no Japanese resources, which sort of killed some of Grasshopper's own resources when their sound programmer simply stopped showing up. Nobutaka Ichiki exposed some of Mikami-san. And finally, yet it's official, Tadayuki Nomaru told Mikami-san to go to hell. And just when you thought there were no commercial breaks, we even got a real advertisement for a fake film referencing a game that was really announced but may as well end up totally fake. In their closing statements, Suda51 showed interest in a longer director's cut edition of Killer7. This sounds like a dream for most fans, but Shinji Mikami thinks it's lame. In Mikami-san's opinion, the world is ready for a sequel to Killer7. For him, the most important obstacle is not that Capcom owns the rights to Killer7. It's whether or not Suda51 wants to make the game. Sounds like Suda51 can't escape the No More Heroes 4 logic, even among his peers. Finally, in the most earth-shattering, one last thing ever revealed in any direct ever published, Suda51 announced Grasshopper is making a new game and it has a story. <laughs> it's not like that's ever stopped them from producing some of the greatest games of all time. But uh, did Suda51 forget he was already exposed playing Grasshopper's new game at the end of last year's Direct? Is he referring to that game or the one that was teased at Momocon? Or maybe it is the Flower, Sun, and Rain remake, but it's an action game now. Because we why doesn't Sumio have a gun? He had one in the silver case. Now it's time for me to take a nap under Ileki Island and brainstorm my predictions for next year's Grasshopper Direct.